Three lives and an unbreakable bond. Our friends at ESPN first brought us this story of a family you won't forget. They are America strong. And here's ABC's Bob Woodruff. Leroy Sutton was just 11 years old when his future was suddenly changed. Walking to school, he was run over by a train, losing both of his legs. As a double amputee, the only person Leroy really trusted was D'Artagnan Crockett, his teammate on their high school wrestling team. Get up, get on my back. Jump on. He has his struggles, I have mine. D'Artagnan has a challenge of his own. In fact, legally blind, born with Leber's disease. So nearsighted, he has to read inches away from the page. Two wrestlers, one who can't walk, carried around by the one who can't see. Theirs is a brotherhood forged through the shared struggles of broken homes and meager resources, but remarkable positivity. They weren't bitter. They had just been dealt a really lousy hand. Lisa Fenn is the ESPN producer who first told their story. Where I come from, there's not really too much of a future in that neighborhood. With the ESPN broadcast, the boys received an avalanche of financial generosity from across the country but no one to help them navigate what to do next. Lisa stepped back into their lives, helping them apply to colleges and manage their finances. You can't go into environments like this and earn the trust of two boys like this who have needs like this and then just walk away. She cared enough to stay and help us out. With that, Leroy went to college. D'Artagnan won a spot on the U.S. Paralympic judo team. His first call? Hey, Lisa. I'm going to London. I love you, too. And so Lisa and Leroy were there in London, cheering and watching as Leroy won critical matches and earned a bronze medal. I did it, Lisa. You did it. You did everything. I'm so proud of you. And next month, this remarkable family will be there when Leroy graduates from college. She's like another mother. Me and D'Artagnan were brothers, we're brothers. And she just created the family, like she was the missing piece to the family.